welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome and if you're not welcome back um my name is vanessa and for today's video i am going to be doing a haul of the stuff that i got today um i went to sephora and yeah i dropped the bag because i needed some new makeup and i wanted to try some new makeup and i've heard some recommendations and it was just time to like you know just get new makeup like it's the season it's a new year like it's about to be 2024 and your girl is ready for today's video i'm going to be showing you guys everything that i got from sephora today um besides two things i got my eyelashes at target and i think something else but i don't remember but once i get to open it we'll see we're gonna go ahead and get started um i'm gonna show you guys everything that i got and yeah okay so i'm gonna start off with the lashes that i got so first things first um so i had hella bags so i just put this bag so i got this bag and these brushes i needed a new um concealer brush so i'm gonna use these two for concealer um and the other ones I'm going to give away because I, I already have brushes like that. So I got that and this bag from Target and my eyelashes from Target. Those are the only two things that I got from Target. Or those are the only things I got from Target. But everything inside this bag um, I got from uh, Sephora. So I did get quite a lot of stuff. So we're going to go ahead and get into that. So again, I got this from Target. I don't know. This is like a, a Sonia Kashuk. Um, I don't know. But yeah, I just liked it. The inside was just a simple makeup bag. Don't that doesn't really matter. I have transferred over to smaller minimal lashes. So that's what I've been going for so so far with my makeup looks. Um, you can go check out my previous videos. I have an updated, or I have a soft glam makeup routine up there. And, um, yeah, you can just kind of tell, like, I've transitioned from big 16, 19 millimeter lashes to, like, 13s, 14s, 15s. Like, something small, subtle, classy. Like, we not doing all the, the ratchet long and, no. We classy over here now. We've we've elevated from the the um the brooms step son to actual eyelashes so the first ones are these so wispy by kiss um if you can let's see Let's get it. So yeah, these are pretty cute. Small, wispy, something minimal. And then these are more for like a full face type. Um, when I do full face and I do my makeup, I like to, depending on how I feel and on the occasion, if I'm going out, if I know the lighting is going to be dark, I'm going to go for maybe like a, um, a little heavier on the eyelashes. Um, so the next ones are the Lash Couture by Kiss as well. So, just like they're, I'm going to definitely have to brush these out, um, if you can see, because they're a little, I don't know how to explain it, they look like a little stiff, like I'm going to need to brush them out, fold them a little bit, but, yeah, but look at the difference between these, like there's definitely a difference. And then these other two pairs of eyelashes, I got them from Sephora. So these were a little bit more on the pricier side than like drugstore eyelashes. So yeah, so the first one is like a weightless, it says fluffed and full. And yeah, and it, these are Sephora lashes. So if you can see these, these are really cute. And then we've got Mari Gold Full Volume Sephora Lashes. You can look at these as well. 
Just nice and subtle, cute, nothing too much. Okay, now we're gonna get into the actual makeup product. Oh, and then I already said I got this earlier, but I'm gonna keep the Beauty Blender and give away these two because I already have these two, and I'm gonna keep the small, the two small concealer brushes. They are, it's Real Techniques, if you don't know what this is. Um, it's a 300 brush and a 402 brush, so yeah, it's just easier to get your concealer because, you know, you don't want to, like, spread your concealer everywhere and you just want your concealer in one spot. And yeah. So, let's start off with, so I have three, I have three brands here. No, four brands. Yeah, four brands here. Um, the first one is, we're going to start off with one size. So, I wanted to try this. I wasn't ready to commit to a full bottle. I wanted to try it first to see how it how it um basically works like it's just the regular one size by Patrick Star. Okay, it's giving very white lips dry shampoo. Smell Kind of smells like hairspray, but not as strong as hairspray, so. Yeah. And then the next one is the one size um, setting powder. So, my sister actually wanted to try this. And, you know, your sister's always got to try. Like, oh, I like this packaging. It's really cute. Hmm. I got the color translucent. There was, um... Only three colors left. Translucent, blah, blah, blah. translucent, um, and then like a honey, a honey color, and then another color. I like this packaging though. This is really cute. It's like 3D. I don't know if you can like. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna open it and see. Let's cut the camera. On. Okay. It smells like plastic so that's that those are my those that's my one size these are my one size products so setting spray and setting powder the next one is a Charlotte Tilbury setting spray as well let me open it for you guys but this one looks like I've heard some good stuff about this as well um, if I can get it open and if you guys don't know makeup is expensive like very very expensive um, yeah expensive so the airbrush flawless setting spray by Charlotte Tilbury we'll see how that works and then for actual like makeup makeup I mean, it's all makeup, but like to go on my face type shit. Besides the um, besides the setting spray, I mean the setting powder. I got the Makeup Forever HD Skin Foundation. So I've had this before. I've had this product before, but it wasn't necessarily my color. So my sister had it basically, and I really like the product. This is what the bottle looks like. I love the product. Um, it's nice and creamy. It's long wear, full um, full coverage, and um, yeah, I like I like it. It's got a cute bottle to it. I have the shade three Y four six. And then for my second makeup forever product is I have an Ultra HD coverage stick, so a uh, foundation stick. So I was looking for an Anastasia brand that I had. Um, well, me and my sister share it. That wasn't working out so well because when I needed makeup, she needed makeup at the same time. We needed the same product, so. But this is the Makeup Forever foundation stick. So I'm going to use this for contour, but it's a foundation stick. Um, it's the shade 
Y505 and it's like a like a dark brown shade so and it's pretty pigmented I tried it in the store um, and it's really creamy so you can either build up work down however you want to use it and then as for oh Miss Dior had to stock up on some Miss Dior like where can you go wrong with our de parfum for Miss Dior. Miss Dior, our de parfum. Get the collection. This is what she looks like. So small, right? So, the whole purpose of me going to the mall today was for none of this stuff. So. I really went to the mall to find something to wear for New Year's. It's um, December 28th. December 28th. 6.49. And New Year's is in a few days. And I wanted to pop out because me and the gals have a section. <clears throat> so, yeah. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Any love y'all want to show, I'm appreciative of it. Because, hey, my time is coming. It's coming. My time is coming. If it really is. Like, I see it in my future. I see it in my visions. And just the content that I'm cooking up for y'all. <laughs> y'all not ready. Y'all not ready. Yeah, not ready. Let me know what are some video ideas you guys want me to do. I'm open to them. And yeah, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day, evening, night, wherever you are, whatever time it is, whatever day it is. I hope you guys have a beautiful day. And I will catch you guys later. Bye. Get the face though. Get the face though. Bye!